You right there? Oh. Okay. So what have we done? What? It's yours. I oh, will get to that in a sec. What we've done to improve their birds' lives and health and safety. You're too cute. Um, so this is her old skirt. It's yours. This is her old rope perch. Um, let's take a close look at this. See that? All frayed. All frayed. And where else? Silly having it on selfie mode. Oh man. Look at that. I mean, if they're chewing on that, ripping it apart, ingesting it, obviously that's going to collect in their crop. And um, it just builds up into a hard ball where they can't eat anymore. Um, they have problems and it has to be surgically removed, which is horrible because look how tiny you are. You're so tiny. Yeah. And where's your crop? Where's your crop? Um, I don't know, just somewhere around here. <laughs> so we are definitely getting rid of that today. I just wanted to keep it to show everyone you don't want this in their cage. Oh my goodness, it looks terrible, doesn't it? Also the huts. This is her old hut. Um, and I've shown these things many times, but I keep showing them because people keep buying them and saying, oh, I want to get a hut for my bird, which is the best. Don't get any. Um, <laughs> mostly for aggression reasons, um, cage aggression, they get a nest and they start protecting it with their lives. They'll kill anyone that comes close. So as you can see, she's ripped holes in this too. Ripped a big hole in here. And also the plastic, oh goodness, plastic inside has all been chewed up. I'm going to rip this open because we're not going to use it. I'm not trying to save it for something. Hold on. Let's try and rip a hole in this. That's oh, nasty. Okay. Oh, wow. Look at the damage. Okay. You want to see something crazy? That. That was a square piece coming up here and across there. So she's chewed all that plastic. That's terrible. Who knows if that's still in her system, you know? Poor little girl. And each corner has damage as well. That's terrible. So these are going into the bin as of today. Also inside, oh wow, it really cleaned up nicely. Um, <laughs> I mean, they'll poop inside there and it'll just build up far out. That's clean. Oh, do you miss your heart, mate? See, just really chewing at it. That's terrible. That's not good. You don't want that. No, we don't want that. I know. Give me kisses instead. That's better. Sit up here for a second. Okay, so what do you want to do instead? What can you give them? Ropes. No ropes at all. No ropes. Whether it's cotton, whether it's... Well, people say Cecil's okay, but I still don't trust it either. Anything can basically cause crop impaction, but you want to choose whatever's safest. Let's take a look in here. So I went out collecting today. And I collected some paperback branches here. Put another one in their tree. As you can see they got the little gosh, it's difficult, beads on them. They love to chew those off. I got the bottle brush. Usually they got flowers but these ones didn't. These have also got beads as well that they like to chew off. They chew the leaves off as well. Chew the little sticks. Where's yours? Hi Scamp. This one's his. So he's been playing with this a little bit. <laughs> Build your own nest, right? The dowel perches. Oh, everyone says, you know, oh, throw them away. You should throw them away. Um, so let's just take a look at their branches. Natural, natural, <laughs> right? I do want some thicker ones for the girls. This one's Sky's Cage. Beautiful, thick. Um, I think it's eucalyptus. It smells like eucalyptus. It's beautiful. Beautiful. How are you going, mate? I'll just put a new branch up here for him. I need to snuggle up in the leaves, under the leaves. It's like in real 
real tree, right? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go see the girl. Um, hello, darling. She just sits here by herself now all the time. I'll put some leafy branches here. She's already started chewing on those. But yeah, I think it's good for you to stay away from everyone because otherwise you'll kill them all. Do you want to give me a kiss? You don't like that it's just guys with me? Oh, you're just too cute. You're just too cute, Bobby. Oh, she's such a little one. Oldest but smallest. Uh, she does have, can you see that? Seagrass. Hut. She doesn't use it at all. She doesn't go near it. She doesn't really go near much of it. But she has... Let's see this. Hold on, sorry about my hand. Look the hole she's dug in this branch. Look at that. She has gone to town chewing this perch, which is great. Okay, so what we did was, if you see in, oh gosh, some of our, do you want to come down, mate? Step up. Step up. We need more training, don't we? Step up, darling. No, I keep saying that. Step up. Step up and I'll give you a kiss. Come here. Step up. Not good. Oh, well, that was good. Thank you. You get kisses for that. Good girl. Good baby. Good girl. Good baby. She says that, but she won't say it to me. She just does the head movement like, yep, you're doing it right. Okay. You want to come up here and sit with your brother? Don't scare him. Okay, so that's... Oh, the lighting. The lighting is terrible. I don't know if you can see her heart. It's nasty. Let me open the side door and try and get it from this angle. Excuse me. Can you see anything in there? Not really. Um, her heart is in there. And it has been destroyed. I'm hoping to get rid of it soon. Because see the build-up? I keep wiping it out. But... And that one's leather. I made that with leather. Bird safe leather, vegetable canned leather, um, which is probably one of the safest materials you can use. And seagrass twine that I sewed it together with. <laughs> Are you excited, Ryder? Oh, you're, are you excited? Hi, what you doing? Want to say hello? You don't? Okay. Hi, Skimpy. Hi, mate. You're too cute. All right. They're the main things. People keep getting them, keep using those dowel perches. I hate the dowel perches, so get rid of it. Yeah, keep your birds happy, safe, healthy. Okay, bye.